My name is Amy and I am a Kingdom Kids teacher here at Word of Faith Christian Centre. Today I will be speaking to you guys about when sin first entered the world. Now sin is really just a very complex word for not listening to God. You cannot listen to God in your thoughts, in your actions or even just in the way you speak. So the first time that sin ever entered the world was with Adam and Eve. Adam and Eve were best friends with God. They spoke to God the way I'm speaking to you now. They didn't have to pray or they didn't have to go to church. They just said hi to God every day, every morning, every evening, every afternoon. They could eat whatever fruit they wanted to have in the garden. But God said to them, just don't eat from one fruit. One tree, don't eat that one. And that tree was the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. So one day, Eve was walking in the garden and all of a sudden the snake came up to her and said, Do you, did God really tell you not to eat from that tree? And she was like, yes. But then the snake tricked her and she ate the fruit. Then Eve tricked Adam into eating the fruit as well. So I'm going to just show you something quickly. This fire and this candle is what we look like when we listen to God. We have this beautiful flame burning. And then comes along the snake. And the snake tricks us into not listening to God. So this glass shows disobedience. Watch what happens when I put the glass over the candle. The flame went out. So the Holy Spirit left the person who didn't listen. So that's what happened to Adam and Eve when they didn't listen to God. Their flame went out. But if you light this candle and you made a mistake, a genuine mistake, a very honest mistake, God sees it. And the sooner you say, sorry, God, the sooner you can be lit back. Let me show you something. doesn't want to work. Ah! There we go. There we go. Did you see that? I didn't even have to touch the candle to make it light up again. It just went up by itself. So that's what happens when we listen to God just by our own self. So not listening to God or sinning against God puts us in a cage and then we'd lose the fire that we had for God. But as soon as you say, Lord, I'm so sorry for what I did, and then you actually don't do that sin again, then the Lord can bring the fire back into your life. So just be a good listener to God and ask Him to help you to be a really, to listen to Him and not sin anymore. And your light for God will burn brighter than ever. Thank you for listening. I will see you here at Kingdom Kids this week.